So this video is going to be about uni essentials and I'm going to do a couple of them. When I say uni, I mean it can be transferred for school, for college, for work, whatever you're doing, you can pretty much transfer these. So I made a list, and by a list, I've scribbled a lot out because I used it as a list for stuff I need to get and it's got prices on and stuff like that and I attempted, and there's like a couple of pieces of paper and stuff like that. So pretty much, yeah. On another note, okay, I just got a text message from my friend Mimo, so shout out to Mimo. And I want to shout out another guy before I get into this. I'm so sorry if I pronounce your name wrong, but I think it's Jose. I don't know if that's your middle name, but I want to call you Jose. So I'm going to call you that because it sounds cool. He's, um, I was going to say Spanish, but he's not. He's from Mexico, I do believe. He's a lovely guy. He's Apparently he watches my videos, so thumbs up to you. And I have now um, started following you. And pretty much... We started to talk and we started to get to know each other and you're a lovely lad and you're constantly, you're a gentleman, let me put it that way, <laughs> which is a good thing. Okay, let's get into this. Oh yeah, I realised it's dark outside, da 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 da, because it's like 25 past 10 at night and I've just stopped. <gasps> Shock! Plot twist. Anyway, yeah. So, some, some of the stationery that you might need is going to be, obviously you're going to need your pens, pencils, rulers, rubbers, erasers, sorry, um, and sharpeners, obviously you're going to need them. I wrote down another, uh, a lot of other things as well because quite a lot of people don't realise how much they're going to need this sort of stuff until they get into the situation where they do. So on my list I have put a journal. Have you ever, it's just like, you've been out and about wherever you are and you're just thinking, I need to remember that for when I get home. And then you get home and you're like, food and other stuff like that, or games and stuff, and you, you just totally forget. It's like, yeah. So, obviously, like, are we uni states that we should carry around a journal at all times? So, just in case to drop down notes and stuff like that. So, a journal's a good thing. And... Actually saying that, I managed to pick up two journals, and they're both this one's better for the pattern. They're both just regular journals, and this is like engraved in it, supposedly. I want to say engraved, um, embedded in, and it's just two owls, and it's the same pattern. You can get this in three different colours. You can get this in purple, pink, or teal. And I don't know why I didn't get the teal one, but I might go, might as well go back for that one soon. So yeah, I write a lot. That's why I need three. Okay, so I've, I've got a list here. A lot of it scribbled out. So another thing, highlighters. You're going to need to highlight stuff. Um, have you ever picked up a book with them? Yep, close it, lost the page, gone forever. Yep, highlighters, perfect for that. Or another thing is sticky notes. You can either fold it in half and just keep it in a tab on the page, maybe underline it or something like that. Um, that is if the book is yours. Do not highlight it if it's not your book, please. Um, so obviously, ruler. a big thing, a big must have for university, college, wherever you're doing, is a stapler. Because you're bound to print something off and you're bound to hand it into your teacher. So, or lecturer or tutor or whatever. But a stapler, you can never find one when you're in college. And then once one person has it, you're their best friend. Now, I found that out the hard way because I bought a stapler and then I had everyone else taking staples. So, everyone, you owe me staples. Um, but, yeah, um, obviously with staples, with a stapler, you need staples. And I say get a lot because some of them, some staplers, I don't have a stapler on me because it's over there on my makeshift def desk for now. Um, blue tack. If you're at home and you need to blue tack something up, or if you're at, coll at college and school, or if you have like a same classroom that you go into every morning, like a tutor room or something like that, then you can put blue tack up. However, many kids will steal it. Well, we do in the UK. I don't, uh, not me personally, but people do, so I don't know why. So I'm thinking maybe just keep it at home sort of thing. So you've got scissors, because you're going to need to cut out. Preferably a small pair and not a big pair. 
Um, sellotape, that's another biggie that you don't really find around in things like that. Um, a hole puncher. I got. I actually got one of them actually the other day. Oh, and back to blue tack. <gasps> it's pink. You can get pink tack. Now when I saw this, I instantly thought of like people like Bethany Motor and stuff like that, and I thought, and I thought how amazing this is. I actually got two, and I think it's limited edition. Um, but yeah. Um, yeah. Where's my hole puncher? Uh, there's my hole puncher. I just got a normal green one for now because the pack I'm going to get later on is going to have a bigger one. So I can, I can carry that one round and I can have my bigger one at home. So we've discussed about that. Post-it notes. Um, I, I said about them earlier, which are sticky notes. Post-it notes, sticky notes. I don't know what you call them. Um, I think would be good is a planner. I don't, some colleges and schools give them to you, so you get them, but when you go to places like college and university, you don't necessarily, so it would be worth getting one of them so you know what you're doing, you've got a timetable, you've got everything you need, you've got a diary, you've got, you've got it all. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I can't even read what this says, so I'm going to move on. Um, Coloured pens as well, ooh, I actually got some of them. Um, I don't know if they're in this bag or not, but yeah, there they are. I absolutely love writing in barrel pens, uh, in the fine liners, and I don't know why, but I like writing in many colours and not just one, because that'll make your work more fun rather than boring. So, yeah. A good thing for, um, bingo idea. That was pretty random, but um, a good thing to have is a pencil pot, especially if you have a desk. Um, because you let's face it, you're gonna either end up borrowing somebody's pen and not giving it back to them, finding a pen on the floor and keeping it and saying it's yours, or you might get given free pens. So in order to keep them all in one place, pencil pot. Um, my pencil pots are over there right over there so I'm not going to get them and they have quite a lot of pens and pencils and gel pens and glitter and stuff like that in so I'm not going to bring them over another thing is glue sticks I get these glue sticks because they're like children's glue sticks and they smell nice um don't go sniffing glues I mean by the pink ones smell like strawberries um in this you get seven glue sticks as, said, as stated there and four are red and three are just normal. So you can have pink glue. Um, ring binders to keep all your loose paper in. I suggest you carry one of them round at least. If you have th things like lockers, then that'd be perfect for you. If you don't like us, then that might be a bit heavy. It, c it can get a bit heavy. Um, obviously, you're going to need a USB stick or a memory stick or something. Save all your work on. You're going to need, this is an optional extra for a notice board or a whiteboard where you can stick push pins in. I'm actually going to get myself a notice board when I bought myself my desk so I know what size notice board to get. And I bought some push pins the other day. And do you want to see them? Do you want to see them guys? They're ducks and they're from Staples. They're £1.50 at the moment and ladybugs. Ladybugs, reflection. Um, pretty much, I got them from Staples, they got like a 3 for 2 offer, and I used my 3 for 2, I used the 3 for 2 offer, and for my freebie, I got, wait for it, the cutest ever sharpener, ever. Again, I saw this and thought of Bethany Motor. But, yes. Um, you need notebooks, you need something to write in, you need paper, you need pens. As I've said that, but where are you gonna put them all? In your pencil case. I like rainbows and pretty things, and I'm quite hippie like that. So I like my rainbow pencil cases. You can get these from the range; they're like a pound. And I've got another one somewhere, but it's getting a bit rough. And I thought I might get another one so I can use it as two, or I can use one for one thing and one for the other, and maybe coloured pencils in one and 
on it. Just pencils and pens in the other. I don't know yet. I haven't quite decided. But I got another one. And oh yeah, this is my post-it notes I got. I forgot to say that. So yes, I think that is it for what I've got so far. But um obviously pencil case, yep, I've said that. Highlighters, yep. Pens, pencils, journals, notebook. And that is it, I do believe, guys. No, you're going to need coloured pens. Oh, no, I've said that. I'm just not here. Oh, yeah. Um, I s suggest if you've got a desk or something like that to organise your desk. Um, because at the beginning of every term, it's the first week's all nice and easy, nicey, nicey, nice. And then, boom, work. So, I suggest either sorting your desks out or stuff like that. And maybe even do a desk tour if you're... If you're not feeling that up to it, you know, I'll roll with it. I'm getting a nice big desk soon, so I have room for everything like that. So I'll do a desk tour when I get it. I might even see if I can video me putting it up and attempt to put it up. But yeah, so that's everything for now for station move wise. I'm going to be doing a couple of, I'm going to do a series of videos. And this is going to be like back to, I don't want to call it back to school because that's what everyone else is calling it. So I might just call it something like School Essentials or something like that. I don't know. Whatever. I don't know. New Year, new stuff or something. I, I don't know. Other side when it goes up. I feel like I'm on the news. I don't know why. I keep looking at the screen and not the camera. That's so bad. I'm sorry, guys. Will you ever forgive me? <laughs> anyway, guys. So that's the first one of this so this is stationery and next i'll do what to carry in your bag sort of thing i, I just did it again i just said oh, what to carry in your bag and i will um do kind of like that and like what to have in, on your bags like if you have a locker i can do what to have in your locker or i can just do that um, I always I might do an organisation video of how to organise your desk and stuff like that. But if you're not up to that, then you don't have to watch it. Okay, guys. So, I'm going to see you. It's like 25 to 11 at night. Dark, hot weather. No idea what that's about. Anyway, guys. So, shout out to those guys again. So, that was... I want to say I could Jose. His name's I could Jose Osha. I'm so sorry. I can't pronounce it. Um, shout out to uh, Jack Package, aka Stephen, my good friend. Um, known him a long time now. Love him to bits. Um, yes. So he just literally popped up. So that's what you gotta do. And a mention to Nemo, my friend. And Everyone else I love, I mention you all. Mwah. So, I'll miss you guys. Miss ya. Love ya. Love ya. Bye.